Hey y'all, welcome to my channel or welcome back. If you are new here, thank you so much for joining us. If you are returning, you already know it. You are fabulous. All right, so today's video, guys, this is episode 161 of our 365 day daily devotionals. This daily devotional is called Jesus Calling. It is by Sarah Young, and guys, it is absolutely fantastic. I cannot say enough good things about this devotional. If you've missed any of the previous episodes, there is a playlist in the description box, and I guess that's it. So let's jump right in. Okay, number 161. <clears throat> seek to live in my love which covers a multitude of sins both yours and others wear my love like a cloak of light covering you from head to toe have no fear for perfect love decimates fear look at other people through the lenses of love see them from my perspective this is how you walk in the light, and it pleases me. I want my body of believers to be radiant with the light of my presence. How I grieve when pockets of darkness increasingly dim the love light. Return to me, your first love. Gaze at me in the splendor of my holiness, and my love will once again envelop you in light short and sweet today. Very, very good. Seek to live in my love, which covers a multitude of sins, both yours and others. Have no fear, for perfect love decimates fear. Look at other people through lenses of love. That one's hard to do, isn't it? We don't always look at other people through through God's eyes or see them from God's perspective. Let me just give you an example. Say, I'm sorry if there's any Marthas out there. We're going to use the name Martha. Maybe Martha lives down the street from you and... And you just really don't like her too much. Um, she gossips and she's, she's, I don't know, whatever. You just don't like her. You don't like to be around her. You don't like her, whatever. What if you're the one that's supposed to, to reach out to her? What if you're the only person that ever invites her to church? What if you stand in between her and her salvation? You're looking at her through your perspective. You're looking at her with, with human eyes and human love, which is completely different than God's love. God's love has no expectations, no exceptions, no, no um, borders or, or boundaries. Or God's love is imminent. It is, it is everywhere and always. It is constant. We're supposed to look at others that way. We're supposed to just constantly be kind and loving and, and let our light shine. I hope that in my daily life, I do that. I want God's light to shine through me. I want people to be like, you know, that Jackie, she sure is, she sure is happy all the time. And, and she, she just, she just brightens the day. I want that. I want people to know how God has worked in my life and how different my life is the closer I've gotten to God. I don't want to shove it down anybody's throat, but I certainly want them to see God's light through me. And I want to do my best to see other people from God's perspective, through God's eyes. We're put here on this earth to serve God and others. I know it's not always easy to do. Trust me. But it's what we're supposed to do. Mm. 
so, so good. I want my body of believers to be radiant with the light of my presence. Radiant. Gaze at me in the splendor of holiness and my love will once again envelop you in light. Praise God. All right, let's do the verses. <clears throat> Above all, love each other deeply because love covers over a multitude of sins. 1 Peter 4, 8. That's a very powerful, ver powerful verse. Above all, love each other deeply because love covers a multitude of sins. Mm. There is no fear in love. But perfect love drives out fear, because fear has to do with punishment. The one who fears is not made perfect in love. 1 John 4, 18. Yet I hold this against you. You have forsaken your first love. Revelations 2, 4. Very, very good. Look at other people through lenses of love. See them from my perspective. This is how you walk in the light, and it pleases me. Try to see people from God's perspective. It's our job as, as believers in Christ to reach out to other people. And that's not always easy to do. Sometimes we are nervous or uncomfortable or, like I said before, maybe, maybe you just really don't like Martha. God loves her and you should too. I hope that makes sense. I hope that I have done my best with this one, but... Just love one another deeply. Just like the Bible says, above all, love each other deeply because love covers over a multitude of sins. Man, so, so good. Mm, so, so good today. All right, if you guys have enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. It definitely helps my channel. Don't forget to share this with your friends and family and subscribe. That would be awesome. Plus hit that notification bell so that you will know each time I upload a new video. All right. Thank you all so much for being with me today. And y'all have a blessed day.